Hi, I'm Jimmy. I'm a vet tech here at the SPCA serving Erie County Wildlife Department. And this fat little fella is my friend, the raccoon. We have a lot of raccoons here in western New York, uh, and some of you probably have seen them in your backyards. So raccoons seen out during the day does not necessarily mean they have rabies, which is what a lot of people think. Um, during the breeding season, they are out looking for food in order to feed their babies. Um, also, you may see raccoons out stumbling around and acting drunk. This may be rabies, but it also may be distemper. So rabies is an invariably fatal disease once you start showing signs. And when you have a disease that's always fatal, you need a test that's 100% accurate. Now, there are blood tests for rabies, but they are not 100% accurate. And unfortunately, a false negative would mean, unfortunately, dead people. So the only 100% accurate way to test a raccoon for rabies is to decapitate it and test the brain tissue. Uh, we do not want that to happen to any of our little raccoon friends. Raccoons are very smart, very charismatic, and very mischievous. We all love these chubby little guys. We love to see them walking around in our neighborhoods. They do a great job cleaning up the trash. Um, some people call them trash pandas, but I just call them adorable. If you see a raccoon acting strangely, or if you find orphaned baby raccoons, the most important thing is to give us a call here at the Wildlife Department at Erie County SPCA. Our number is 716-875-7360, extension 247. And you can always call us for any orphaned or injured wildlife that you may find.